Hey folks, so we just finished um, a great workshop with some people down at CDC and I got a question from them that I get all the time. So I thought I would just quickly answer it here for you. Not something significant enough for a blog post, but something still really good to, to know. So one of the questions was, what is the difference between a bar chart and a column chart? Like when should I use one versus the other? Well, they're both length. So length is gonna be completely fine, very familiar way for us to read data by looking at the length of it. But columns are the ones that go up and down, like building columns. Bars are the ones that go side to side like you drink off of. And the way that you'll know which one you wanna pick is basically based on what happens to your, your category labels. So I know some of you have had this happen to you before, it happened to me too. You ever made a column chart, the kind that go up and down, where your labels at the bottom get so long they start to wrap down onto like five lines? Or your your software will like tilt your your labels at an angle. Maybe you'll even get the dot 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 indicating that your labels have been cut off. Yeah, that's your red flag that you need to rotate your whole chart from a column to a bar where your labels are going to lay out on one horizontal line. So that's going to be the way you would determine whether you need to make a column chart or a bar chart. Okay, there you go. I'll put up another question the next time we have a workshop tomorrow and we'll see what we get.